What's up guys, Wipe Your Eyes here coming at you with another quick and easy tutorial. This one's going to be on Dead by Daylight in regards to the EAC air that is notorious on this game. Pops up all the time, everyone knows what it is, the developers refuse to fix it. Whatever, different issue. Here's how to fix it though, at least it works for me. If it doesn't work for you, don't call me an idiot because honestly, I just wanted to share it because I thought I could help someone out. But I know this has worked with a couple people so far, so hopefully it does the same to you. If not, I wish you the best of luck. So, library is what you're going to go to under Steam, you're going to go down to Dead by Daylight, you're going to go to Manage, and then you're going to go to Browse Local Files. Alright, that's going to pop up right here, if not you got to click on the little uh, folder thing down at the bottom of your screen. EAC stands for Easy Anti-Cheat, and for some reason the game thinks you're a freaking cheater, which we're not, because, I don't know, we're good people. <laughs> so, Easy Anti-Cheat. Alright, you're literally in the game files here. You're going to right click on it, you're going to delete it. <gasps> Alright, <laughs> you took away that file, which means the game will no longer work correctly. Here's what happens if you try to launch it. It's going to just immediately say the files aren't found. You need the AC air to play because they think you're going to freaking cheat. So, at this point, right click, manage, and then we're going to go to... Hold on, hold on. Properties, I apologize, properties. And then we're going to go up here to local files. We're going to verify integrity of game files. If your Steam looks slightly different than that, it should be the same button. I notice that this is updated or a little bit different, so if you have an older client, you are still going to go into the properties section of this and look for the verify integrity of game files. All that's going to do is to make sure that it's going to scan to make sure everything's updated and that all the files are within the game. So it's going to detect that that EAC uh, folder is gone and it's going to replace it. So I'm going to go ahead and skip ahead to when this finishes because all this is going to take a little bit and then when we get there we'll go from there. Alright guys, we're sitting here at 100% complete, just finished. It took about 4 minutes, if that. So, uh, all you gotta do is hit close, close out of this, and then all you gotta do is launch your game. Should be good to go. Go ahead and re-hit yes for that because it's thinking that it's a brand new file. This is a lot faster than reinstalling the entire game. It would work, you could do that, but this is quicker. This took 4 minutes, so it's a pain. You might have to do it you know, every couple weeks or something like that, but uh, this is definitely the, the way to do it. So hopefully this works out for you guys. If it does, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more quick and easy tutorials. Take it easy.